Hi, my name is Pop. I'm making a video that shows how to use SearchMonkey. SearchMonkey is a program for finding words in across multiple files in Ubuntu. When you're using a word processor, you can look up a word in a file if you've got that one file open. If you are looking for a word that is in one of several files, you've got a problem because it's difficult to find one word that is in some file somewhere. I've got a list here of 50 files. I've got these 50 files in one folder and I'm gonna look for one word. Now I can open up one file and think well maybe it's in this one and I will look for that word and I'm going to con do control F and I'll look for that word. It's the name Jose and it's not found. Well gee it's not in that file so I've got 49 to go. Maybe it's in this file. Let me see. I've opened up this file and I'll do control F and I'll look for Jose again and sure enough I found it at least once I'll hit find the second time and there it is the second time the third time and so on but let's say it's one particular word and I'm looking for that one particular word and it's somewhere in these 50 files well the program search monkey is in accessories it's a free download you get it from the Ubuntu Software Center and I'm going to load search monkey and when I load search monkey I can put in uh, which folder it looks in you put that in here select folder and then here you put in whatever word you're looking for I'll put in this proper name Jose and I'll hit start and sure enough, Jose is in all of these files. It's in file 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Gee, I've got it lots of times, but not in 10, 11, 12, 13, then 14, 15, 16, and so on. And you can hover on each one, and it will show you each instance of Jose. It's outlined in blue. It's a really, really versatile program, and I recommend it very much. There are a couple problems with it. I'll show you. All of these are RTF files. It can find in RTF or text files and several other kinds of files. Unfortunately, it does not work with the native file system of LibreOffice, OpenOffice.org. I don't think it will find Microsoft Word doc files either. I have got all of these 50 files in ODT right here and I'll show you what I mean. I'm going to uh, open up these 50 files and they end in ODT and this one number two here I converted it to RTF. It's really easy to do. I'll open up this file LibreOffice Dot org. It's an ODT file and you can save the file with save as and instantly convert your files to from ODT to RTF. Uh, you just hit the right arrow, put in a dot RTF, oops you have to write RTF, RTF, save keep in current format. Let's test it. And sure enough there I've got the RTF file. I recommend this program very much. You can get it in Applications, Ubuntu Software Center. After the Ubuntu Software Center loads, you can look it up by name. And you can see perhaps from the you can perhaps see from the uh, uh, green arrow that I have already got it 
and the green arrow indicates that I've already downloaded Search Monkey. All you have to do to download it, of course, in Ubuntu is highlight it. And then here this says remove, but in other folder in other files it would say install, and you would just hit the word install and it downloads. And when it downloads, it automatically in Ubuntu goes to accessories search monkey. It's a very versatile program you can tell it to look things up uh, very very clearly uh, with an expression builder. Uh, you can get quite precise in doing that. Um, I don't think that's necessary for 99 percent of the cases. The only thing you've got to do here is tell it where to limit the search. If you select the entire documents it'll look recursively in all of the folders inside of documents. If you've got one specific uh, folder it will look only in that folder and the search is real quick. My name is Pop and I thank you very much.